Idris, thanks for thanks for joining us. A um, good game on, on Tuesday night and, a, and another goal for yourself. Uh, how did you find that game? Uh, yeah, it was um, it was a good game, especially first half. I thought we were very dominant, and uh, yeah, second half we made it hard for ourselves. But main thing was the three point, and then happy to get a goal as well. So mm. that's good. Good finish as well. One of them you just kind of watched it drop. <laughs> uh, yeah, to be fair, it's a good header from Omar, and then I just stay at the back post. And uh, it dropped to me and I didn't really think about it, I just volley and then you went. So, yeah, good goal. Going into the weekend as well, obviously Crawley Town tomorrow. A win tomorrow can make the last kind of four or five fixtures a really good run for the O's. Uh, what are you making of tomorrow's game? Uh, yeah, it's going to be a very important game. Uh, I think every game is important, but um, it's going to be good because uh, it's going to be another game at home. Uh, if we can get the three point, we're getting closer to our objective. And then, yeah, game by game, as uh, Omar Beckel said. <laughs> Well, we've had a few questions in for you, um, so from the fans today, so we're going to yeah. jump onto them. All right. um, our first one is, do you have a player that you base your style of play from? Um, and that's from Alfie. Um, yeah, I really like Verratti and I really like Valverde as well. I think he's very good. Yeah, nice. Um, Nacho asks, who's the best player you've played against? Probably Ben Rama. Wow, when, uh, how was that? That was... When they were in the, in a chump and they nearly went up, I think when we went down with with switch, it was unbelievable. Like just dropping shoulder, dribbling, step overs. It was. I knew it was going to be big after that game. Mm, it was yeah. that good. Um, Hayden asks, how, how did it feel to represent Tunisia? Uh, yeah, very proud. Uh, obviously, um, from my dad's side, I'm Tunisian, and then uh, my dad's born there. I've got all of my families there, and that. So, yeah, very proud, and uh, for my dad, for me, and then yeah, very happy. Is that your next kind of big target to try and get in that Tunisian team? Uh, yeah, of course, yeah. Yeah, um, yeah I want to represent Tunisia, obviously. Play AFCON, play a World Cup, that would be uh, unbelievable, yeah. Mm. Who are you supporting in the World Cup, Tunisia or France? Nah, Tunisia, 100%. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, Nick Riley's asked, who wins in an arm wrestle, you or Idris Elba? Me, 100%. <laughs> 100%. He's quite big, Idris. I know, but I back myself. <laughs> Um, Julian has asked um, what do you have off the menu at Five Lads after a game <laughs> um, I've got I'm going for um, half chicken medium uh, potato wages and uh, mashed potato nice um, Stephen has asked who was your favourite footballer when you were a child uh, Zidane wow yeah. how come uh, I don't know it was just popular big players for France kind of same background uh, Arab as well so probably why is there anything you take from Zidane's game into your own what would you say it is uh, I'd love his calmness on the ball and uh, how he make everything look quite easy mm, nice um, Els asks what was your thoughts when you saw the Tunisian flag at the ground uh, very surprised but very happy obviously uh, it mean a lot for me and then I thank them for that again yeah and then they've got the uh, song for you as well have you yeah. heard that one yeah, yeah I heard that uh, like a few it? times yeah very good yeah do same you... very happy and then thanks them again good song do you know the original song Oasis what? do I no I don't know the original one uh. I only know my one my one's the original now though <laughs> is it um, Dan's asked being a very versatile player um, which role out of a 4 8 and 10 do you enjoy playing the most and where do you think you're best uh, 8 and I think eight is my best because um, I like just doing both sides of the game. I like defending as much as helping the team attacking. Obviously, I need to get more goals and assists, but I think, yeah, eight because I'm, I can run and then I can mm. link as well, I think. you played, obviously, four quite a lot this year. How do you think mm. you've kind of grown as a player this year? Is there anything that you've added to your game? Uh, yeah, 100%, because, to be honest, it's my first season playing as a number four. I've never done it before. And uh, yeah, like the gaffer helped me a lot in playing one, two touch, uh, receiving in the back foot and then turn, uh, get it from the defender. Never really done that as a single pivot. And then uh, I think it's good because I, it, like, I can learn more. And then now in the future, I could play a few more positions, which is always a good thing. Mm. Um, P Readers asks, have you tried the East London Delicacy pie and mash? And if so, what are your thoughts? And I'll give you a photo you can look at uh, <laughs> and you can talk us through. But I never tried it. You can talk us through what you're seeing there. Nah, I never tried it. And I can't lie, I don't really want to try it. <laughs> don't really want to try it, but it's only, I don't know, maybe it's good, but I don't know. Maybe what do you think? It's quite, it's all right, yeah. It looks, it, right? Be it looks better than, it, uh, it tastes better than it looks. Is it? Yeah. Maybe yeah. before the end of the season. Maybe if we're champions, you... Yeah, we can I give you one it, of them. Yeah. All right. um, one of the other questions was, who is your most difficult opponent so far this year? Stockport, wait. 
Defo. Uh, yeah, they were very good at all. Um, they pressed very high. Um, yeah, especially the first 20, 25, they were on us, and uh, I thought it was a very hard game. And then, yeah, it was good to get three points. Um, and Roger Robbins has asked, uh, what has been your best moment at Orient? Stop for wait. All my back hole scenes. Uh, yeah, that one because uh, tough ground to play um, to play into, and uh, they were good at all. And uh, to win, it was two one in it. Mm. To win two one, that was very good on the coach on the way back. Where everyone was buzzing, and yeah. that's it was good. Barrow away up there as well, giving everyone a high five. Yeah, Barrow away as well. Yeah, <laughs> but Stockport was just like I don't know the scene like because it was was it one zero. Well, he was 1-0, was it? When? When both, When almost scored. Yeah, yeah, yeah 1-0, 1-0 and then almost scored. Yeah, and then I don't know, anything, everything about it was very good, I thought. Mm. Yeah, well, brilliant. Well, that's, um, that's our questions for today, so All thank right, you very thanks. much. Thanks, thanks.